I, um, I've been doing this piano thing for a while, like 13 years since I picked it up again after like 10 years of not playing at all. And you know, I kickstarted myself with the absurd goal of recording both books of Bach's Well-Tempered Clavier, which somehow I managed to do. It took me five and a half years, but whatever, who cares? So the early recordings from like 2008, 2009 were audio only and pretty poor quality. We lived on a busy two-way street in Brooklyn in an apartment with bad windows. Within five blocks, there was like a police precinct, a fire station, and a hospital. So, you know, constant sirens, honking, big trucks roaring by. There was nothing to be done about it, so all that noise just became part of the fabric of the recordings. I recorded this particular fugue almost 11 years ago to the day, August 22nd, 2009. And I loved it. I always think of Bluto, you know, from the old Popeye cartoons. It's because of this ha 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 theme. <laughs> sort of suggests to me this big fat cartoon villain, Super Arch. And I think it was the first four voice fugue I, you know, tackled. And it's in this horrible key, G sharp minor, that just means double sharps and shit all over the place. It's dense. So 11 years later, I'm gradually redoing a lot of the early audio ones, and this one came to mind. It also sticks out in my head because there's a well-timed horn honk in the 2009 recording. And so, real smug-like, I hauled it out thinking I could just ink it in a weekend. Shit's hard, yo! I had to relearn the thing from the ground up, man. From like, glacial tempo to whatever it is that I ended up at, like, quarter note equals 80. And this here passage, two bars. I've never spent more time on two bars of music in my life, at least eight hours on just those two sumbitchin bars. So that'll teach me. You'd think by now I'd know better than to think I can just play any Bach cold. I mean, it's just fuck. Thank you.